Today guys, what we're going to be doing, we're going to be working on overloads, okay? So behind me is the session, on here it's, it's laid out, okay? So in a minute there'll be four defenders, and there'll be four gates behind them. There'll be three cones that the defenders have got to work along, okay? So if I'm a defender, they're the greens here, they, they've got to work along the line, okay? They can't come off the line just to start off with. And if I was Yui now, he's only allowed along the line, like that, okay? He's not allowed to come, come forward or he's not allowed to come backwards. What you've got to try and do, you've got to try and get past him. So if I was like this now, I've got to try and shift it and try and get through, like that, okay? If Yui tags me as I'm going through, then I don't get the point. If I get through, I get a point. Okay, guys? You're going to go for 45 seconds and then we're going to go for a rest. Okay. Off you go. Nice and fast, you've got 45 seconds. Good, keep going, keep going, well done. Perfect, right, so have a think now, just have a think. What was, what was the topic we were working on when, I, when, we, when we sat down? Overloads. overloads, perfect. So, what do you reckon in here, in this, in this session now, you could create an overload? Um, How could you do it? One, one person to distract. Them. Ah, perfect, so this, so when I was just watching then, you got more success when there was what? Two people. Two people or? Three. Or more. So, if it's 1v1, it's slightly diff more difficult because he's only watching you. But if there's a few of you going through, it's, more, it's easier because there's a more, bit more of a distraction. Okay, just have a think about that now. This time now, we've made, I've made the, the three cones into a triangle. So it's not a flat line this time. So this time now, the defenders have got a bit more space to move. So they can move forward and they can move back now and sideways. All right, but they're still locked into, their, into this mini triangle. What you've got to do, you're still working by yourself, still working by yourself, so can I borrow your ball? You've got to try and dribble through the triangle without being tackled, okay? If I get through, so if I get through, I get one point, but if he tackles me, I lose that point, okay? What if it's a bad tackle? Now you try and stay on your feet, okay? So what am I looking for you to do now? So if you're going 1v1 against Nishan, how do I want you to be? Skills. You, you skills? Yeah, express yourself, that's one thing we're looking at. And fast, good. Good, we want a bit of pace now, a bit of match pace. So imagine now you're in a match and you're driving towards the defender, okay? Nothing worse than a defender when someone's attacking you with pace and a skill, okay? So try and put that into this session, okay, guys? Ready? 45 seconds again. Ready? Go! Good, you still, remember, we're still working on that topic, overloads. Good, well done Ryan, great, great trick, well done. Remember what we said, the two things we're looking at when we're in here, when we've got the ball? Skillful, and nice and fast. Get your head up Ryan. Well done Max. Okay, next, um, next session, or next bit we're gonna look at now, is a carousel, okay? So, in a minute you're going to split yourselves into twos. We're going to have two defenders and there's going to be one goalkeeper, okay? So in this kind of section here, there will be one defender and one goalkeeper, okay? In the section behind me, the second section, there will only be one defender, okay? So, you're both going to go at the same time. So these two are going to go down this side and these two are going to go down this side, okay? So it's a 2v1. What you've got to try and do, you've got to try and work around the defender, try and get past him and try and get a shot into the goal, okay? Same on this side, still a 2v1. Once you've, once, you've, once you've through, have a shot and try and score, okay? Defenders, if you win the ball, you can try and score yourself as well, okay? Once you've had a go, so once these two and these two have had a go, they will go and join the back of this queue, okay? Once these two have had a go, they will join the back of this queue, okay? So it's in a circular motion. Do you understand? Yep. The three things that we're looking for is speed, movement, and, and good finishing, okay? Because you've got a bit more of a challenge on this one because you've got to get past the defender and the goalkeeper. That one, only the one defender, okay? So remember what we've learned in the first session, in the warm-up. How do I want you to be? 
How do I want you to be? To try and get past that defender. Perfect. So you only want the defender to see one person. So if, you, you, if the two are in here, we don't want him to see both. We want to try and be sneaky so we can only see one and we can try and play around him into the space behind him. Okay, guys? Okay, I need two defenders, please. Okay, same again. Ready? Play. Off we go. Yeah, off again. Good. So he's got to think about both now. Finish. Okay, play on, play on. Okay, see? It was on his shoulder, so we could only see. And then we played it through, it was in. And he had a clear shot on goal. Okay, good, finish. Well done. Grab your ball, round the side. Good, you just, you pick one of them. Okay, Ryan, your ball's gone. Your ball out. Nishan, higher up. Well done. Okay, let's go. Play on, play on. Good, well done. Good strike. Unlucky. Move round. Try and think about that now. When you've got that 2v1, use it to your full advantage. Make sure they can't see both attackers coming at you. Okay? Okay. Okay, last last um, bit before we get into our game. So you're doing really well so far, so far in terms of working on our overloads and really exploiting that 2v1 situation, okay? This time now, we've got the blue box behind me, which is gonna be here. And we, in it, there's gonna be three attackers and one defender. Outside the box, there'll be one defender and one goalkeeper in here, okay? So what you've gotta do, you've gotta make three passes inside this box. As soon as you've made that box, as soon as you've made them three passes, the three of you will break out, okay? And then you will go and attack the, the goal down there, okay? Three short and sharp passes, move for each other. As soon as you do that, break out the box and then you can go and attack, okay? So what we're looking for, so can anyone remember the key points what we spoke about so far? Speed. Speed, we're looking at speed. We're really trying to exploit that space, okay? Because if there's three attackers going at one defender, and we're going nice and fast, it's gonna be really hard for that defender to try and judge and try and mark all three of you. Okay, what else? That's good. Intelligent, intelligent, intelligent what though? Intelligent what though, right? Have a think about what that means. Pardon? Movement, good. Good, so intelligent, that means like we said about the runs off the ball. What about the person on the ball? How could the person be intelligent on the ball? Look up. Look up, yeah. But what, what, what can they do with the ball that's intelligent? Have a think. What do them very creative centre mids do when they've got the ball? Space. What do they do with the ball? They hold it. Play into space? For who? Play in space for who? For, for others that are running into space? For the people that are providing good movement? Okay, so we're on that ball. Who does it very well? Who exploits, who exploits the uh, overloads very well? In terms of a team. Can anyone think? Think of a team. Think of a team that does well in terms of their overloads. Barcelona, that's one. Anyone been watching the Euros? England. England, England do it quite well actually. They had 53 chances so far. Not, but they've not scored many, okay? But they're still creating chances, which is good, okay? So, you've named two of them. Fast, movement, and clinical, but we'll, we'll count that down as finishing, okay? Okay, guys? Okay, can I have two, go uh, two defenders, please? Three passes. This one's live. Ready? One, two, three, go. Good, well done, good defending, but I'm happy with the position, okay? You might have been able to cut it back, but I'm happy with the position so far. Be quick, ready, play. One, two, three, break out. 
Well done, well done. That was, that was fast. That's one of the things we're looking for. Well done, well done. That's good. Next three in. Go on, Ryan. You stand up. Okay, you stand up. Okay, ready? Play. One, two, three. Break out. Off you go. Well done, well done. Rebounds. Well done, well done. Oh, nearly. Okay, well done. This time now. Bit more of a challenge. You've got two defenders and you've got a mannequin. So you've got a bit of a distraction and an added defender. Okay? Defenders, if you win the ball, defenders, if you win the ball, you've got to try and dribble back into the blue box. That's how you get your point. If you win the ball, Ethan, play to the yellows. Okay? Yes, Ryan. Okay. First three in. Any three. Any three. Let's go. Ready? Three passes. Play. One, two, three. Off we go. Break out. Good. 3v2 now. Think about where you need to go. Good. Well done, well done. Next three in. Next three. Let's go. We're going nice and fast. Guys out of the way. Ready? Play. One, two. Good. Break out. Break out. Off we go. Good. Good. Think about where Samuel's going, Nishan. Play to the yellows, Ethan. Play yellows. Play yellows. Play yellows. Play yellows. Nice and fast. Well done. Drive into the box. Drive into the box. Good. Well done. Great touch, Huey. Great touch. Okay, right, EJ, stand in the middle. Okay, this time now we're gonna go into our game. So remember what we've learned, remember what we focused on. So this time now, EJ is a floater, okay? So if the blues have the ball, he's playing for the blues. If the yellows have the ball, he's playing for the yellows. So whoever's attacking has an overload, basically, okay? So we've, we've done it in the warm up. we've done it in both sessions. Let's try and use it into the match now. I'm gonna set it up to start as free play. So enjoy it. But remember what the topic was and try and, and try and if you can implement something that we've learned in the session into the game. Okay? Whichever team's attacking, use EJ to your advantage. Ready? Play, off we go. 